What up? We ain't spoke in a while. And some of y'all probably woke up on the wrong side of the bed. Well, I'm going to give you some advice that's going to help you through your day or your week or maybe through life in general. I'll start off by saying this. No matter what it is you're trying to do in life, put yourself in a position where you cannot be denied. See, your life is one big relationship, and in order for a relationship to work, each party has to bring something to the table so that it can balance out. If someone's putting in 90% of a relationship and then their partner's putting in 10% of a relationship, it's probably not going to work because the person putting in 90% is going to get frustrated. It's not just financial. Maybe the dad keeps the finances while the mom keeps the home. Maybe the dad takes care of the kids while the mom keeps the dad sane. There has to be balance. Same thing goes with life. Let's say you're trying to get into Ivy League school. They say we could get you this level of education, but you got to bring us this level of grades. Let's say you want a raise. You have to prove that you're worthy of getting that raise. We'll give you this amount of money if you bring this amount of qualifications. And that's how it is across the board. On top of all of that, you got to compete with other motherfuckers. Damn, Susan want that raise too. That bitch. Competition. No matter what you're trying to do, there's always going to be competition. If you're trying to go to a better school, there's competition. Get a better job, there's competition. A better career, there's competition. You're not the only one trying to get in a good school. You're not the only one trying to get a better job or land that star role in a movie. Motherfucker, you got competition. Oh man, you right, they storm. I got competition, so what do I do? You put yourself in a position where you cannot be denied. I live in Hollywood. Out here, 90% of the people want to be in the entertainment business in one way or another. But what separates the working folks from the ones who are not working? Yeah, you have to have talent. Yeah, you have to work hard. Yeah, you have to have a little bit of luck. But the ones who are really working are putting themselves in positions where they have to be chosen. Entertainer A has a million fans and a decent voice. Entertainer B has 10 fans and an amazing voice. The industry's going to go with A every time. Just because B has a better voice don't mean that they can sell tickets. A already has a million fans, which means they'll sell out shows. She put herself in a position where she cannot be denied. You have to network, get out the house, get to know people, kiss some fucking babies. I seen nobodies that are way better than somebody's, but they still that tree in the forest. I wholeheartedly believe that it's your attitude and energy that takes you to the top. My mama raised eight kids in the slums of Baltimore and never complained once. So why should I? We all have days you feel down, days you feel depressed, days you want to give up. Because we human, right? But those are the days you should go harder. So when the good days come, you can really kill it. There's no one way to be successful. But if you master your craft and bring something to the table, could be knowledge, experience, your fan base, then you can't be denied. You say you're passionate about something, you want to be the best at something, prove it. Because you ain't proving shit by telling the same five people in your circle about it. Prove it to yourself. Prove it to the world. You can be whatever the fuck you want because everybody needs something from the billion dollar corporations to a simple relationship. If you figure it out and you bring that balance, you can't be denied. Stop complaining and start working. Use your heart and your mind more. Network. Get to know people that will help you be where you want to be. If that's not your circle, get the fuck away from them. I've been talking for too long. i got to go to the gym. But I'm going to leave you with this. Nobody going to take advice from somebody that's broke or struggling. You got the greatest ideas in the world. You want to help your friends and family? Get your shit together. If you made it to this part of my rant, you're a fucking hero. Tweet me with that hashtag below. Y'all motherfuckers is crazy. Y'all just be listening to me go on.